here what's going on y'all it's your boy pj and y'all already know why i'm here ha <laughs> another madden 16 player ratings reveal now i know i've been getting a lot of slack on these i don't understand why maybe it's because the people of the ps4 who don't like my rosters coming to my videos and disliking my stuff but hey I'm not, I'm not even doing anything wrong, giving y'all exactly what I see on EA. But this time I'm doing a little bit different. I'm actually gonna go in depth this time, so you guys could get a perspective of how I feel this. I know I didn't do it in the other ones, but you guys will see in this one that I'm actually gonna do it. So yeah, so starting off, we got 96 overall the Dominican Sue, the new Dolphins player who just signed a $114 million contract ever given to a defensive player the highest oh my goodness now let me just go ahead and what ea saying right here he make an instant impact in miami with his 98 strength he also got he got a 97 power move also a 95 hit power a 95 pursuit and a 92 block shedding so you guys already know the dominican sue was one of the best defensive tackles if not the best defensive tackle in the NFL right now. And I actually do think he's the best one in the NFL currently. Him coming from Detroit, going to Miami. I honestly think Miami going to have a beast team this year, y'all. So, hey, on Madden, they might have a beast team also. Because you guys already know Cameron Wake, one of the best ends in the game also. So, you guys know the Dolphins defense is going to be crazy. You got 95 overall Gerald McCoy of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. McCoy is the centerpiece of the Bucks defense and one of the top pass rushers in the NFL. His 98 power moves is the best among D tackles. And he also has a 92 strength, 87 tackling, 87 block shedding, and 93 pursuit. So yeah, Tampa Bay also got a good defense also. You guys be sleeping on them, but they got a good solid defense in my opinion. But yeah, guys, you guys already know the Bucks got a good defense with McCoy and Levante David back there. So they're going to get down through there. I, I expect the Bucks to go at least like Four and twelve. Okay, let me stop playing. I expect them to at least get six wins this year. I'm not expecting too much of them because they still a young team with James Winston coming in there. But hey, we'll see what we can see, right? And also, let me just go back to the Dolphins. I think the Dolphins gonna go, go at least. They might go like at least get ten wins. It just goes how the Tom Brady situation goes. That's how I go. That's how I feel. All right, so now we go to the double header in the Buffalo Bills with Marcel Darius, 94 overall, who is 6'3", 331 pounds. Darius and the rest of the Bills' excellent defensive line should thrive under new head coach Rex Ryan, who's a defensive kind of coach. Marcel is one of the best tackling D tackles with a 95 tackle, a 94 strength, 92 power move, and 94 block shedding. I honestly think Buffalo is going far away, especially with, like I said, the Tom Brady situation. Yo, Buffalo might go, uh, like, I can't even say it right now, but Buffalo might go far. The only thing they need is a quarterback. But, hey, I believe in Matt Castle now. Matt Castle been showing us some stuff. I mean, you saw what happened when Tom Brady got hurt. He went 11-5 with the Patriots. But, hey, I'm just saying. And then we still on the Buffalo Bills with Kyle Williams, the old man himself. 6-1-3-0-3. And they say that Buffalo defense led the league in sacks and ranked high in every category. Williams still shine with great stats across the board, like 90 strength, 88 tackling, 91 block shed, 87 pursuit, and excellent 94 play recognition. Like I said, y'all, the Bills might be going places. Places where we haven't seen the Bills go in a while. Super Bowl? I don't know. We'll see. The AFC kind of tough because you guys know my Colts. We coming for y'all. <laughs> All right. So now we go to the final. And we got Aaron Donald of the St. Louis Rams. Now, this is a second-year player. I always thought this dude was good in my opinion anyways. But, hey, this dude coming in here with a 92 overall. Hey, he, he wasn't the only rookie that got a boost from last year. Over there, Balcom. But the reigning defensive rookie of the year should be even better in year two. His matter 16 rates include 93 strength, 90 tackling, 92 power move, 90 pursuit with a defensive tackle best 82 speed. That's really good for a defensive tackle, man. So this dude got some, this dude almost as fast as Marshawn Lynch on the game. <laughs> and it's kind of crazy, man. Hey, we'll see what's going to happen. Also, they got Haloti Naga on the Detroit Lions now. After the Dominican Sioux came from the Detroit Lions to the Dolphins. Isn't that kind of weird? But hey, we'll see what we'll see. I think it's going to be one of the best NFL seasons yet. And hopefully no BS happen like happy in the Super Bowl. But anyways, guys, this has been your boy PJ. And I'm signing out. 
like I tell you guys every day, I'm gonna come out with these videos. If I see some haters on my shit, I'm gonna just end either fucking block them from the comments, or I'm gonna end up just disabling the ratings for a while until all these I don't know the dislike boss or what. But yeah, guys, it's been with PJ. I'm signing out. I'm stuck. I'm done rambling for today. I'll see y'all later. Peace.